Today for this video, what I want to do is talk about finding the complement and the supplement of an angle. Um, when the angle is given to you in radians, so most of us are familiar with the complement um, of or complementary angles having a sum of 90 degrees. Um, so when you're dealing in radians, if we convert 90 degrees to radians, it ends up being pi over 2. And the same thing with supplementary angles. Um, supplementary angles have a sum of 180 degrees, so in radians, the sum would be pi. So if you're asked to find the complement and the supplement of an angle such as 2 pi over 5, um, what you are going to do is you are going to take these two rules right here and basically you're going to subtract the angle that you're given. So in order to find the complement, we would take the fact that we know that together the 2 pi over 5 plus another angle have to add up to be pi over 2. So instead of setting up as addition with a variable, we could just say that it's pi over 2 minus 2 pi over 5. Now remember that when you're adding or subtracting fractions that they do have to have a common denominator. So the common denominator of 2 and 5 would be 10. So the first one we would have to multiply by 5 to get it to be 10. So we would end up with 5 pi over 10. Minus on this one we would multiply it by 2 because 2 times 5 is 10 so we would end up with 4 pi over 10 and now that they have a common denominator we just um, combine the numerators together so 5 pi um, over 10 minus 4 pi over 10 ends up being 1 pi over 10 or just pi over 10 and I'm going to leave this as an exact answer if you were asked to put this as an approximate answer you would just hit the pi button divided by 10 in your calculator um, but I'm gonna leave it as an exact answer for this video alright so for the supplement the supplement, remember that the sum together adds up to be pi. So to find the missing angle or the supplement of 2 pi over 5, we would just do pi minus 2 pi over 5. And again, remember that we have to have a common denominator. So in this case, the common denominator would be 5 because um, this one has an understood denominator of 1. So I can take 1 times 5 to get 5. Um, so pi could be rewritten as 5 pi over 5 minus 2 pi over 5. And so if I simplify this, um, 5 minus 2 gives me 3 pi over 5. And so the supplement of 2 pi over 5 is 3 pi over 5. So just remember, it's very simple. Um, if you are dealing with radians, if you're trying to find the complement, the sum is pi over 2. If you're trying to find the supplement, the sum is pi and you just subtract the given values from that angle. As always, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please let me know. If there are additional topics you need me to cover, please let me know that as well.